Hello. Because this video has to be less than 5 minutes, I'll be real quick and I just want to show you that my Raspberry Pi is connected to my laptop and the server is up and running. So first thing here I want to show you that my server is reachable from outside world. This is my um, uh, public IP address, as you can see here. Then for, I'll just quickly try to refresh. Yeah. Um, register. Yeah, it's uh, requesting for data here. All right. Um, all right. So here, as you can see, I made account. It's uh, with nickname QT Final. And first thing I wanna show you is um, okay. I'll log in on other account. Other account nickname is QT Student. So. Now, now, all I want to do is uh, attack first account, which is QT Final. If I attack him, you'll sh see battle log. And then on other account, you will receive notification that someone attacked you, in this case, QT Student. So you can attack him back. And yeah, you're going to lose because... <laughs> You don't have any items on your profile <laughs> so here you can update your uh, status message all right so main feature of this game is uh, world you can walk uh, right left up and down it's 2d it's made based on uh, canvas and everything is manipulated with uh, javascript and jquery so um, when you step on this uh, yellow exclamation mark, um, every exclamation mark have its own unique ID with room ID. So data is being fetched based on that ID and all the monsters. And for example, if you attack this warlock, you'll see battle log and then uh, how much experience did you um, took from him and gold and also you have chance to drop item in this case it's ice spell book so you can check check it out in your inventory so this is the item then you can equip that item and then it's gonna appear on your profile and your um, attacks gonna go up defense based on uh, it depends uh, on uh, attributes of that particular item here as you can see you have uh, statistics like how many monsters you killed when did you create your account um, on home page you have uh, uh, top 10 players uh, top 100 I used uh, view models for this one for example um, you have global chat but it costs uh, 100 gold to write anything. I have 98 at the moment. Um, uh, oh my god, almost four minutes. I'll just quickly show you here uh, some of the code. So I used the uh, MVC pattern um, in ASP.NET Core. So I have controllers here. Um, views and of course models okay so where is it uh, models here okay so for example player model have this yeah just regular properties anyway as you can see here Every five seconds, Ajax request is being made um, from every currently logged in user. It's just asking for um, if there is any uh, notifications that are um, of that account ID. So, um, if you want to see more of this game, I attached a gameplay link in my project report. But unfortunately, I cannot show you anything more now because it's already five minutes 
of the video and that's um, unfortunate <laughs> anyway thank you I hope you enjoyed